these historic missions are number one prosperity for the African people we the Pan-Africanists this is what we identified long ago our leaders here whom, whom I read we were young working under them and we identified historic mission number one to be how to create prosperity for the African people historic mission number two strategic security how can Africa be secure and, and historic mission number three taking advantage of the Undugu Undugu is a word for brotherhood for fraternity of our people given to us by God so these are the three historic missions we the Pan-Africanists isolated long ago number one how can Africa achieve prosperity for its people? Number two, how can Africa achieve strategic security for its people? And number three, how can we use the Undugu, the, the Umoja, the oneness, the brotherhood to achieve the other two? We always start with the question where does prosperity come from? If you say that the African people need, need, need prosperity the question is where does prosperity come from? Can prosperity be achieved by begging from other countries because that was one issue some people told you that you could be prosperous by begging from other countries now our answer is that if that was the case if begging could make countries If begging could make countries prosperous, then all the African countries would be very prosperous by now because they have excelled in that enterprise of begging all these years. <laughs> Africans have begged Wanang. Eh. Africa wana omba, 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 omba. Wanaomba huko, wanaomba kule Wanaomba chakula Wanaomba nguo Wanaomba usalama So, our view Is that if, if begging was A source of prosperity Then all the African countries will be prosperous by now because they have done it for all this time so would Latin America from where you see desperate throngs of people walking on foot and going to the prosperous United States of America those who watch TV you have seen people from Latin America walking in big numbers on foot going from Latin America trying to enter United States even the other day I was watching TV I saw them where then does prosperity come from prosperity comes from producing a good or a service 
with a Chibaro. You remember Chibaro? Aymar. What do you call Aymar in your, your, your dialect here? Echibaro is uh, assessing the optimal returns, the profitability. You produce a good or a service after you have calculated its profitability. And you do so sustainably and selling that good or somebody buying your service and paying you, the service provider. In that case, the producer of the good or the service will get income and solve the problem of food, problem of shelter, like the house, problem of clothing, problem of health, problem of education for the children, etc., as well as creating jobs for other citizens and paying taxes so that the country can stand up. If that is the answer for achieving prosperity, if the answer for, for prosperity is producing a good or a service, 